Hi there everybody, it's Diwali time and that's why I have this question for you. So Arun, Bishu and Chetan, these are three folks who decide to distribute sweets in a society with house numbers 1 to 500. Now Arun gets to distribute sweets in the house numbers 1, 4, 7, 10 and so on. Similarly, the house numbers to which Bishu gets to distribute sweets are 2, 7, 12, 17 and so on. Similarly, Chetan gets to distribute sweets in the house numbers 3, 10, 17, 24 and so on. We have to find the sum of all those house numbers that received sweets from all these three chaps. So let's get started people. The first observation here is that the list of house numbers corresponding to Arun, Bishu as well as Chetan is nothing but an AP that is arithmetic progression and we are aware of the fact that when you have an AP with first term A and common difference D its general term which is the nth term is given by A plus N minus 1 times D correct so corresponding to Arun's AP the first term is 1 and common difference is 3 so its mth term will be given by 1 plus M minus 1 times 3 that is 3M minus 2 Similarly, you will find the nth term for Bishu's AP, which will come out to be 5n minus 3. And similarly, you will find the general term, which is the rth term for Chetan's AP as well, that will come out to be 7r minus 4. Now, what you need is that house number or those house numbers which are sitting commonly in all the three APs. So, we are going to start by equating the general term of the first and the second AP. That means 3m minus 2 equal to 5n minus 3. This will give you m is equal to 5n minus 1 by 3. Now the positive natural values of n for which m comes out to be a natural number are all these that you can see. What is the next step? Equate the general term of the second and the third AP as well. What do you get? You get r is equal to 5n plus 1 by 7. Again, the positive natural values of n for which r comes out to be a natural number from here in this equation are all these that you can see. And in both these lists of possible values of n, the first entry which you can see common is 11. What does that signal? That signals that corresponding to 11, the term that you will find which is 5n minus 3 will give you 55 minus 3, that is 52. This is the first house number which is sitting commonly in the three APs of Arun, Bishu and Chetan. But what about the second house number, then the third house number, then the fourth house number and so on? Obviously, these will occur in a pattern, that too of an AP. So for that, we need the common difference as well, right? Which will be, yes, the LCM of the common difference of the three APs, which is 3, 5 and 7. The LCM comes out to be 105. What does this imply? That the AP that you will get with the first term 52 and common difference 105 will represent those house numbers that are getting sweets from all these three chaps. But remember, we are only allowed to take numbers from 1 to 500. So you only end up getting these five house numbers. When you add them, 1310 happens to be your final answer.